In this tutorial we are going to look at the circle tool. Uh, the circle tool belongs to the drawing toolbar and if the drawing toolbar is not turned on you can find it under view, toolbars, then drawing. When we first click on the circle tool it shows us up in the um, display box that we have 24 sides. What this is is the little segments that are used to build up a circle. So for example if I was just to quickly type 3, enter, it now has a three-sided circle which is actually a triangle. If I was to type 6, enter, um, it would be a very low poly uh, circle which means not very many sides to it. If I was to type in um, 24, that's a pretty good sized circle. Um, it is a good a number of segments, so it, ha it will have a light file size um, and it should look pretty good when it's in the model. Um, depending on what you're trying to do, if it's just general architecture, uh, I would use 24 sides, but if you're trying to show something a little bit more detailed, um, like engineering, I would recommend higher segments or sides. So, we first need to click to begin with the circle tool and draw out your radius and as you know the radius is half the circle it starts from the center and goes out to the outside edge so if I was to type in 2000 enter um, obviously the radius is now 2000 and the diameter is 4000 so we can test that by getting the dimension tool and um, clicking on the circle and it will tell us the diameter of that circle. Uh, a cool thing we can do with the, the circle is, um, as we learned in an earlier tutorial, um, it is a curve, so we can either explode it, um, which will turn it back into segments or individual lines, or what we can do is actually go to right click Entity Info on the edge, so again, right click on the edge, Entity Info, um, and it tells us the segments and the radius in here as well. So what we can actually do is we can type in um, 1000 for the radius, and that will actually change, or 1500. Um, and the segments we can also increase as well, so maybe we double that and type in 48 segments. So you can now see, looking at the circle, it's looking a lot smoother. We can keep doing this only until we modify it. So now if I was to push pull that, we've modified it, we no longer can modify uh, the radius. Oh sorry, we can modify the radius but we can't modify the segments. Um, so if I was to reduce the radius, I could type in 1000 enter and it would actually um, create a, like a truncated cone.